welcome to my channel. This is Ilfe here. I'm coming to you with a little initial product review video for the Anastasia Contour Cream Kit. A little flappy thing singing out there. I got this from Macy's. Surprisingly, they don't sell this in Ultra or Sephora, so I have to go into Macy's and get it. And it's only for $40. Um, anyways, I got this one in medium. As you can see, the colors are here. They also have three shades of this. They have a light, medium, and deep also. So this one is, for the colors, this one is banana, cream, warm coil, coral, warm coral, 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 sorry, coral. And this one is also chocolate, nude, uh, chocolate, cinnamon, and nude. And the main ones I use is chocolate and nude. No, chocolate, cinnamon, ah, chocolate, cinnamon, and nude. And also sometimes cream. Cream kind of gives me a white look in the face for my highlighter, so I kind of don't use it as a highlighter. The only time I do use it for a highlighter is unless I kind of dabble my MAC Studio Foundation on top of it to kind of get rid of that white look that it gives me. Let's kind of do some swatches for you. And if you notice, like, I really don't have to dip my finger into it to get it on here. It I ran out fingers. It I ran out fingers. Um, uh, Okay, so look at that. Up, uh, up. Uh. Okay, look at that. If you can see that, I'm so sorry. Look at that. Chocolate. Uh, sorry. Let me see what these are called again. Chocolate, cinnamon, nude. Chocolate, cinnamon, nude. Warm coil, cream, and banana. I cannot say coral, coral, coral. I cannot say warm or coral while wow, messing it up. I'm sorry. But yeah. So these were like, I just kind of swirled my finger in it and then did that. So you can see how very pigmented they are. They are very bright, you know? They are definitely like there. You don't need a lot. You don't have to dip your brush, like dip your way into it just to get what you need, you know? They are very like creamy. Like see how creamy this is. Like, for real. Like, that is so amazing. That just tells you that they're easily blendable. Like, you don't really have to try to blend these. Like, you can just blend them with your finger if you wanted to, you know? That's just how blendable they are. And I really love coil. That one's a really pink. I love it. And also a highlight. Um, like I said, cream. Cream, I don't know, I guess maybe I'm like fucking up with it, or maybe it's my brush that makes it look too right, or maybe I'm just imagining shit, because I am I have cream on right now, and I didn't use the MAC foundation to kind of work with it, so maybe I'm just tripping, you know, but yeah, so far I love it, I really do love it. Um, I'm still getting used to it, I will admit that, so this little uh, review about it might not be very in-depth about it or anything like that. Like how if I would have used it a few months, like I've been using this for like two months already, and I love this. This one is the Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, Contour Kit, the powder version of it. This one is the one that you'll find anywhere, like at Ultra, Sephora, Macy's, you know, any Sephora, any Ultra, you'll find this one. You can't really find this one they only had this one at Macy's I think I said that already but that was the only place I found this one uh, they didn't even have it online on so Sephora or Ultra so I'm guessing it's like an exclusive thing you know this is the medium to tan contour kit powder version um, between these two I would probably go for the uh, between these two I probably still work with this one more because I'm used to it you know I know exactly what to do but the only thing that kind of made me like, you know, if I love this one so much, then why am I using this one? Um, the reason is because this one, like, it blends very well. But I want a more natural looking kind of contour. And what I'm trying to say is this one gives you like a powder look. I, I don't know. And this one gives you like a more flesh 
Like it's your actual skin, you know, look. I guess that's what I'm trying to say because I've seen it in a couple videos and I've seen how this looks on me and I prefer this look because when you put it on that oil just kind of, I mean not the oil but the cream just kind of moves along your skin and stuff like that and it kind of blends in with your skin, you know? So it looks like your skin. It looks like an actual, like that's your actual, um, like cheekbone and all that kind of shit. That's your actual skin deepness i don't know what i'm trying to say but yeah it looks realer i guess you can say so this is what kind of brought me onto this one i still love this one i'll use this one anytime out of the day i have cream as my highlight here and um like i said it gives me a white look i don't really like it um i guess that's just me being picky about it because i like a more natural like cream has like a yellowish kind of undertone to it i would prefer uh peaches and creams orange tone you know over the yellowness you know i just don't like yellow i just want like a pinkish pinkish look because then that gives you like a um a flush look you know a bright look a flush bright look you know that's what i would like to have instead of like a yellow what i do so listen close oh my god we're done with that okay guys i'm sorry about that so i definitely prefer the powder look over it i'm still getting used to this so i guess i'll come to you with another video of how the cream contour works with me but until then we're kind of still working this out for watching guys i am so sorry i'm jumping all over the place and i'm rambling and i'm crazy with this i am getting used to talking to the camera and i'm getting used to doing this while my boyfriend is in the other room you know and i'm trying to find my voice you know for videos and stuff like that so just bear with me as time goes on and as i make these videos so have a nice day guys and thanks for watching all of my parents were real man i start to see hi guys I dropped it. <laughs> I dropped it on my fur rug. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. We're done with that. We're done with that. Okay, guys. I'm sorry about that. But until then, we're kind of still working this out. So thanks for guys watching. Uh, thanks, uh, thanks for guys watching. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye, guys. Why do I keep putting this up in my face? <laughs>